What are dyads? Dyads are kind of old-fashioned math, and they still come up once in a while, so here's what you need. A dyad is basically a vector that has another vector as its coefficient, right? So you just write two vectors side by side. This is not a dot product. This is not a cross product. It's just two vectors side by side, and the order matters. So if you do vector next to vector, that's a dyad. If you add up dyads, you get a dyadic. Let's say this whole thing is A. You can say A and dot it with 1, 4. If you do that, what that means is you take the 1, 1, and that's just a coefficient, and you take the 2, 3 dotted with 1, 4. And then you take the second one, which is 0, 1, and again, the dotting is on the right, so you grab the rightmost one. This comes out to 2 and 12 is 14, so you would end up with 14, 1, 1, plus 10, 0, 1. In other words, you get a vector, 14, 24. So if you have a dyadic and you dot it with a vector, you get a vector. You can also dot on the left instead of the right, and that's a different thing because you're going to dot with the first vector of each dyad in the dyadic instead of the second one. So these combine into 1 plus 4 is 5, 0 plus 4, 4, and those combine 18, 23. So a vector dotted with a dyadic gives a vector. You can even take a dyadic and do two dot products and end up with a scalar, a number. Dyads occasionally come up in engineering and more rarely in physics, but there's usually other ways of presenting this information these days. But in case you ran into a dyad or dyadic, and you want to know what the heck is that and how does it work, this is what you have.